Good day everyone. We are the group 5 and we're going to answer the following. Let's get started. Number 1. Is the integral 3 over x dx? The integral 3 over x dx. So, yung number 3, ilalabas natin siya at ilalagay natin siya sa unahan. And yung may iwan sa loob is yung number 1. And magiging 3 times 1 over x dx siya. So, that's the final answer na po. And sa pangalawa naman, the integral 1 over x dx, ang nangyayari po ay magiging ln of x siya. So, ang magiging final answer po is 3 times ln in the absolute of value of x plus c. Problem number 2. The integral of quantity 4x raised to negative 2 plus 6 squared of x minus 6 over x squared dx. Then, ipaghihiwalay muna natin sila or i-distribute natin yung dx. So, the integral of 4x raised to negative 2 dx plus the integral of 6 square root of x dx minus the integral of 6 over x squared dx. Then, proceed po tayo sa power rule. So, magiging 4x raised to negative 2 plus 1. Yung 6x square root of x natin, haayusin muna natin siya kasi naka square root pa siya. Magiging 6x raised to 1 half. Then, plus 1. 6 over x squared naman ay para matanggal ang fraction, haayusin din natin. Magiging minus 6x raised to negative 2 plus 1. Kaya naging negative 2 dahil ang denominator natin na x squared inangat natin. So, magiging negative siya. Then, solve na natin. 4x minus 4x raised to negative 2 plus 1, magiging 4x raised to negative 1 baba natin yung exponent over negative 1 plus 6x raised to 1 half plus 1 magiging x raised to 3 halves over 3 halves minus 6x raised to negative 2 plus 1 magiging 6x raised to negative 1 over negative 1 plus c. Yung c, lagi po natin lalagay sa last. Then, kung gusto natin matanggal ang negative sa 4x raised to 1, magiging negative 4x raised to negative 1 lang. Plus, copy lang natin ang 6x raised to 3 halves over 3 halves. Then, minus ang ginamit natin sa 6x raised to 1 over negative 1. Dahil negative ang denominator, magiging plus ang gagamitin natin. So, plus 6x raised to negative 1 plus c. Next naman ay may like terms tayo na negative 4x raised to negative 1 at uh, positive 6x raised to negative 1. Pwede natin silang combine. Magiging 2x raised to negative 1. The, at para naman matanggal ang fraction sa 6x raised to 3 halves over 3 halves, ang gagawin lang ay 6x raised to 3 halves over 1 times 2 thirds. Yung 2 thirds, pinagbaliktad lang natin ang 3 halves. So, uh, cancel natin ang 6 at 3. Magiging 1 ang 3 at ang 6 ay magiging 2. So, 2 times 2 is equal to 4. 4x raised to 3 halves. Para matanggal ang negative 1 sa exponent ng 2x, magiging 2 over x. Then, plus yung 4x raised to 3 halves, ang x raised to 3 halves ay nanggaling sa square root, magiging 4 square root of x cubed siya, plus c. Or, ang ating 4 square root of x cubed ay may, ay pwedeng simplify, magiging 2x plus 4x square root of x plus c. At ayan ang answer natin. Problem number 3. The integral of quantity 9 raised to 2x plus x squared minus t over 4x squared dx. Then, substitute muna natin ang dx. So, magiging the integral of 9 raised to 2x dx plus the integral of x squared minus 3 over 4x squared dx. Sa, sa 9x, 9 raised to 2x, gagamit tayo ng formula na the integral of a raised to x 
dx is equal to a raised to x over ln a. Mag ang a raised to x natin ay 9, 9 squared. Magiging 9 squared over ln 9 squared. Ang sagot ay 81 raised to x over ln 81. Para naman sa, sa the integral of x squared minus 3 over 4x squared dx, ipaghihiwalay natin siya. Magiging the integral of x squared over 4x squared dx minus the integral of 3 over 4x squared dx. Pwedeng mag-cancel sa x squared at yung denominator na x squared. Ang matitira na lang ay the integral of 1 fourth dx minus e, sa 3 over 4x squared, iaangat natin ang x squared. Magiging negative siya. So, minus the integral of 3x raised to negative 2 over 4 dx. Then, ilalabas natin yung mga constant. So, 1 fourth the integral of dx minus 3 fourth the integral of x raised to negative 2 dx. Then, kukunin natin ang integral nila. So, 1 fourth integral ng, ng dx ay x plus ang um, integral ng x raised to 2. So, gagamit tayo ng power, power rule. x raised to negative 2 plus 1 ibababa muna natin over negative 2 plus 1 is equal to x raised to negative 1 baba natin ang exponent over negative 1 since negative 1 ang denominator negative ang ginamit at minus ang ginamit magiging positive na siya magiging plus so plus 3 fourth x raised to 1 plus c then sa, sita, sa yung c lagi na nasa dulo ilalagay then, ipagsasama na natin ng 81 raised to x over ln 81. At, ang nakuha. Ipagsasama na natin ng 81 raised to x over ln 81 plus 1 fourth x plus 3 fourth x raised to 1 plus c. Yung ln 81, pwede siyang masimplify at ang positive 3 fourth x raised to negative 1. So, copy muna natin ang numerator na 81 raised to x. Para makuha ang, para masimplify natin ang denominator na ln 81, ganito ang gagawin. So, ln 81, ang perfect square ng 81 ay 9 squared. So, equals sa 9 squared. Ibababa natin ang exponent. Ilalagay natin siya sa gilid. So, 2 ln 9. Since yung 9 ay uh, perfect square pa, e e equal siya sa 3 squared. Then, ganun lang. Then, ilalagay natin sa gilid ang exponent. So, 2. Since, since may 2 dito, uh, ita times natin siya. So, 2 times 2, ln 3 is equals to 2 times 2, 4, ln 3. Kinapi lang. So, ayun yung magiging denominator natin. So, 81 raised to x over 4 ln 3 plus copy natin 1 fourth x plus uh, ibababa natin yung negative 1 x raised to negative 1 sa denominator. So, 3 over 4 x plus c. Ayan na yung answer natin.